Hey guys, it's Amanda and welcome to my room tour 2018. So when you first walk in, there's this cute olive branch that I turned into a wreath and it was from Target. So go get yourself one of those. And basically when you walk in, we don't have a lot of furniture, we don't have a lot going on. It's very simple and I don't even know, minimal, boho? I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, when you first walk in and close the door, we have these coat hanging command hooks that we got from Target just to keep our closet a little less cluttered because we got a lot of coats. And then these are my shoes that I just throw in my little basket. And on this side of the wall, I have a hat I always wear and it's cute as a decoration. And then these are the purses that I kind of rotate between and always have, so they're just ready and available for me. And then the first thing I guess I'll show you is the bed because that's pretty much the main attraction. Um, so the wall hanging macrame thing I actually made. I found a tutorial on it and it actually came out pretty good, I have to say. I just found the branch like at a park we went to and then bought some macrame thread, is that what it's called? From Amazon and it came out awesome. Like that's, so that's kind of like our backboard since we don't really have one. And then all the sheets I got are from Target and the pillow. Okay, everything is white because that's just my aesthetic. I just like that. And then this pillow is like kind of an oatmeal color. So I feel like it matched the macrame wall hanging art just really well and it brought it all together. And then this blanket is amazing. It's also from Target. It's more of like a pumpkin-y orange color, but it's kind of coming off really red. But it's just like a nice pop of color for the holidays. I'm obsessed with the whole setup. Anyways, this is the Ikea bookshelf. I'm pretty sure it was a bookshelf, but we're using it as storage. Um, on top of there, we have this little clock from Target, some candles from Bath and & Body, and then just cards and pictures of my friends and family. Love it. And then... The actual bookshelf itself, we were supposed to get so my boyfriend can store his records, and then I kind of took it over. <laughs> so basically, the start at the top, we have his only section, which is all his records and a couple books. And then right next to it, by the way, I got these baskets from Ross, if anyone is interested. They were $7.99, and that is a deal, let me tell you. But I store all my makeup in that one, so it's accessible and like right on top for me. Right below that, I have the only jewelry that I own really. Just these little rings, this little plant. I think that was from Michael's, I wanna say. And then a Target jewelry holder and the watches and the, f I literally have no jewelry, but that's where that goes. And then the next compartment, I keep all my electronics for my computer and my camera, just shoved in a little white container. I have a file folder, my laptop, and a little bag of hand sanitizers, because you need those. Then I have my books on this side. I kind of picked the nicer titles, you know, so it goes together well, the colors. <laughs> yeah, I have a lot of books there. Down there I have my perfumes, deodorant, and it's like a mirrored storage case my best friend gave me. I keep it there because I don't know where to put it yet. And then this one is literally my junk drawer. I have markers, pens, all my sewing things, just random stuff in there. But if you tuck it away, you can't even tell. It looks nice. So that's our bookshelf. On this side of our dresser, I have my work bag. I always take that to work with me. And then this little bag, I just love the stamp. It's from a store called Cargo. Then I also bought a wicker basket. My boyfriend uses for his hats. This is kind of his section. This is all his stuff and cute pictures of us. You know. And then he has like his stickers and gum. Then I got this lamp from Target on sale. It was only like 20 bucks. I love it. It's so cool. Uh, it had a different lampshade before, but I kind of messed it up and tried to paint it and it came out mild good. So we got this white one from Ikea, if you're interested. And then this shelf dresser. This dresser is also from Ikea. Um, we have laundry over there. And then this is kind of like my nightside table where I keep my water and my reading material. And this three-piece drawer is set is from Target. I kind of lined the inside with some paper 
You could do this with like any kind of paper, like wallpaper, wrapping paper, whatever. Just so like you can't see what's inside and it looks less cluttery, you know, you can shove everything in there and no one will know. Like I have my bras and bralettes on the top one, my socks in the middle one, and underneath I have like scars and winter accessories. Uh, yes, yeah, so this is a great idea if you don't want people to see inside those clear little drawers. I recommend that. Life hack. And then we back up and this is the only source of light we have in our room. You can see the trees outside, it's beautiful! But I hung up some Christmas lights to be festive and I just like the way it looks. And then in this little corner, I do eventually want to get some plants. I just haven't gotten around to it yet to add some greenery. But for now I just have this uh, lamp. And the shade doesn't fit, it really bothers me, but it is what it is. We got that shade from Ikea as well. The calendar is from Target. And the mirror, I painted gold because I felt like it matched kind of the decor better. That is from Walmart, it was like five bucks. Or was it Target? I don't know. But they have those cheap mirrors and we just painted it and it looks way more expensive. Then, this is our closet. Uh, I'm trying to be quiet because my roommate was sleeping, so you just get a sneak peek. It's just a bunch of sweaters, everything I hang up, and then that's crap I need to um, make look nicer eventually one day. I just haven't gotten around to it. And then finally, the last piece of wall art. I also made that. I'm not really proud of it though because like the string was way too thin, I feel like, and it gets tangled at the bottom. But it was like my first piece ever, so it's cute and I hang it there. And that's my room. Very simple, very plain and neutral, but once I get my green plants, I feel like it'll all come together, but I wanted to show you guys. So thank you for watching and I will see you next Sunday. Bye.